Hi Pisces, welcome to your monthly reading for August 2021. I am Charlene Lizette. If you're new here, hello, hi, welcome. Thanks so much for stopping by. If you are returning, a massive thank you to you. As always, I do need to give gratitude and adoration to my great queen, the Morgan, to whom all my work is devoted to. All right, Pisces, let's see what's happening for you, my boo. Uh, for the general monthly readings, we pull out three cards for career and finances, three cards for general overall energy, and three cards for love and romance. Okay. First, right off the bat, I got to tell you that your August is going to be busy, very, very busy. Okay. But now we know why. Okay. This is, yeah, this is huge. Oh yeah. I was feeling that. Okay. Okay. Let's see what's coming. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Hold on one second, please, sir. Okay. Okay. <laughs> sometimes I get so giddy with these readings because you know I get excited for you all and I'm like this is what am I doing here what a mess that was the seventh house I'm just gonna say that so let's see if it comes out again okay no void of course pause in time change of plans and a stellium uh okay Okay, so, so so one of you, one of you, some of you may be manifesting a romantic partner here, okay? Uh, others of you that are, are in a romantic relationship may be manifesting more balance in your love life, okay? Like maybe you've been working too much and you want to find some type of balance. Ain't gonna lie, it looks like somebody's making their way towards you. It's here, okay? But it's just gonna take time, okay? It's right here. It just looks like it's taking some time for this connection to develop. Uh, it could be that this connection is taking its time because it's a, like a slow moving energy, okay? Or like either of you wants to move slower in the union, like you're, none of you are wanting to rush into it, okay? I'm gonna show you your mantra card, which is fear. I realize that I'm testing my resolve to live in the energy of love, okay? When I see this, I immediately feel like some of you have been really hurt in the past, okay? Some of you have felt um, some deep pain in your love life, in your life period. Um, I'm feeling very emotional as I'm saying that, um, and the sun is shining through, hilarious. Um, but I feel like you're gonna have, I feel like this is this is the month where things ease up for you in particular around love around being able to have like that home that that life that happiness that um that partner that you wanted you know like i feel like you're fiercely independent and you've done so much work on yourself but here is this moment for you to finally share all your happiness with and your woes with and this is about you finding somebody who you can share your life with Void, of course, pause in time, change of plans, limbo, and improvisation. I do feel like August will bring forth, like, rapid change, okay? With your career and your finances, we start off with the Three of Wands, the Four of Swords, and the Strength card, okay? You're leaving shit behind. I'm, like, I'm feeling you. You want to cry? I don't want to fucking cry because I just did my makeup and I look good. So I'm trying really hard not to cry for you. Um, and, and because of the energy I'm picking up, but it is, like emotional stirrings like there's a lot of energy here like whew, it's like it's here it's right here okay um so i am going to tell you if you have rose quartz slap it on there baby if you got green adventuring slap it on there baby if you've got pa Mal palakite i was gonna say malachite slap it on there baby hold it on okay um, do a meditation okay your heart chakra really like honor your vessel and yourself okay because you deserve to have this love that you have emitted to the whole world. You really do, Pisces, okay? You deserve love. You deserve kindness. You deserve respect. You deserve a community. You deserve all these beautiful things. And with this, I really feel like the one thing that's holding you back from opening yourself up and, and being vulnerable, even with the fact that, like, I feel the tears wanting to come. I feel the emotional stirrings in my heart. But I also feel like you're resisting healing this shit because you're afraid you're afraid of being that powerful being pisces and you know what pisces you are capable of being this person you are capable of having forgiveness you are capable of having compassion and love and all these beautiful energies okay your past doesn't define you okay and as i said that 444 on the clock your past does not define you in career and finances you're leaving some stuff behind as you make a huge plan moving forward okay this is about you 
sorry this is about you making a plan moving forward in your career in your finances in your life all right what kind of a business do you want how much money do you want coming in there are things maybe in the past that have kept you stuck and limited and this is the energy of you bringing it back to only the essentials and moving forward i'm going to tell you there's going to be a lot of energy okay i know that the four of swords is about rest recuperation and relaxation but when you see the general overall energy you'll see why i'm saying this okay I feel like it's really important for you to work, do your thing, but also self-care, self-love. And above all, have the strength and the courage to believe that you are capable of overcoming this rapid change that's occurring around your career and your finances. I don't think any of this is bad, Pisces. I think all of this is really, really good. It's just going to feel a bit turbulent. Like, you know, when you're on a plane and they're like, hello, this is your captain speaking. We're going to put the seatbelt sign on because we're going through some turbulence at 30,000 hype whatever this and that like that that's kind of what it's feeling like but after that you're going to be just fine okay the ten of swords clearly something had to wrap up it had to okay look when you ask for change you have to understand that the universe is going to shut down every fucking door every road every journey that is holding you back from getting that change okay the universe listens it's us that we ignore we're like nah okay I, I know i said i wanted this but i'm not willing to do the work and i'm gonna keep trying to pry that door open mm -mm. this is you closing it done ten of swords shut her down i think that's also why void of course and fear showed up because i think there's fear around change for you pisces but nothing to fear baby nothing to fear <laughs> because you are manifesting this you're manifesting that life, that ten of pentacles. You are working so diligently at like cultivating the right energy, the right frequency, the right vibration to attract this ten of pentacles. Okay, hi, are you coming in to talk to Pisces? Yeah, even Raven's coming in now to come tell you like, listen, Pisces, it's time for you to get your shit together. Okay, you know how powerful you are. You know the gifts of the universe that you have. That ten of pentacles, you want it? You got it. You know that song? I want it. I got it. That's that's you, baby. You just got to want it enough and you got to believe, okay, in your convictions that this is yours, that you deserve it. Okay, cultivate it, manifest it, work for it, the law of attraction, all that jazz, all right? Because I'm seeing this being a very, very, like a month of turbulence followed by like the beautiful blessings that come along with it. All right, this is the time where we dive into your love reading. So here's where I say if you want to book a live one hour reading with me or if you want to shop over at Starcy Jewels and pick up your modern day amulets, take a look at the description box below. To do so, I create crystal jewelry using either gold or gold filled pieces um, to support you in your spiritual journey, okay? I love modern day amulets, okay? The ancient people used to use them all the time like the ancient civilizations. Uh, right now I'm wearing the Anna. It's a 14 karat gold chain with clear cords and I'm also wearing this new necklace which hasn't launched yet because I haven't been called to name it yet but I absolutely love it. It's so fun. All right and these are a bunch of bracelets that we have if you're into bracelets or anklets. Gender neutral pieces are available as well. Okay um, honestly all my pieces are gender neutral. It's got to be what vibes with you. Okay I, I also created pendulums. Those are going to be on sale so make sure you take a look at the website. Sign up to the mailing list to find out. Yes this is handmade created this is not your basic pendulum all right i made these for you um let's ask a question for the pendulum so make sure you ask your question i'm gonna ask the pendulum to show me yes the pendulum to show me no for the pisces collective and then we'll get you your question answered all right okay thank you pendulum this is for the pisces collective can you please show pisces collective the yes so it's a circle for you Thank you, Pendulum. And then Pendulum, can you please show me no for the Pisces Collective? Back and forth, you saw that. Back and forth, no, circle, yes, all right? Okay, Pisces Collective, go and ask your question now for the Pendulum. Pendulum, for the Pisces Collective, the people watching this video, the question either yes or no, can you please tell them if it's a yes or a no? Yes is a circle, no is a back and forth. So back and forth.
Yep, it's a back and forth. So that would be a no for you, okay? Thank you so much, Pendulum. All right, let's move into your love rating, okay? We got the King of Cups, the Ten of Wands, and the Six of Pentacles. Okay, let's see what's happening here. Oh, we got attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Honeymoon, enjoy the bliss of the holiday time together. Yeah, I remember some of you that are in a relationship, I think this is a time where you're looking for more balance in your connection. Okay, there's Raven. Oh, okay. And then we got very soon and pay attention to the red flags. Okay, so the red flags to me, Raven, sorry, baby. The red flags to me, I feel like are you, those of you that are in a relationship, where have you been neglecting your love life? Okay. And for those of you that are single, where are you allowing fear to block the energy of love from entering into your love life? Okay. That's what I'm picking up on big time here. Yeah. Pay attention to the red flags, the queen of cups. That's you. Okay. Uh, two of wands for very soon. Wow. You got two of wands, three of wands. Yeah. Uh, six of pentacles attraction. Yeah. You got the six of pentacles here too. So really work on like, being at the vibration it's one thing to say it it's another thing to be it okay and then you got the knight of wands for honeymoon hoo, hoo, hoo. for those of you death at the bottom there's something there's something transforming here look for those of you that are single i feel like you really need to work now on letting go of the pain the suffering the obstacles and the challenges that were brought forth in your life in the past okay because it's about you being balanced oh my god the queen of the king oh <gasps> For, it's about you being balanced, okay, and emotionally secure. You're also putting down a burden and bringing more equality back into your love life, okay? So when I talk about the burden, it's like, you know when you're hurt in the past and you carry that with you? This is about you shutting down that past hurt and really reopening yourself up to the idea of love and being vulnerable, okay? Um, for the feminines, this is for those of you that identify with feminine energy, I think you may have some blockages around your love life right now, or I think you're very, like, cautious, but it's almost like the universe is saying, baby, you got to learn to balance and attract attract romantic love by living in this moment fully like enjoy your life and the universe will deliver because you've got the queen and the king of cups so there is a partner coming towards you i see it here okay very soon decide what you want and clearly decide on what you want so it comes to you now two of wands it's you making the plan and saying this is the type of partner that i am attracted to da, 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 da. boom now it's gonna come and for honeymoon i feel like for those of you that are in a relationship it's gonna be very hot and heavy august okay and for those of you that are single uh, you could very well meet somebody and have like a one night stand if that's your jam okay pisces thank you so much for watching your august reading raven thank you so much for destroying the whole reading all right thank you so much for your likes your comments your shares your subscribes thank you for booking readings with me and for shopping over at starcy jewels all the details are in the description box below we'll see you on the next one see you later alligator peace out bye